In this experiment, we're investigating different soil types. We're going to compare three different types of soil for water, air, sand and humus content and then decide what types of soil are which. Our first task, task one, we're going to compare the volume of air in each soil. So first of all, I'm going to measure out 10 grams of soil and add it to our syringe. So our first soil type A, we will measure 10 grams. Then we're going to transfer our 10 grams into our syringe. The syringe is capped at this end to prevent the soil running straight out. So we're going to measure the volume of the soil at the start. So our starting volume is 12 mils. And then I'm going to push down on the plunger for soil A and see how much air content it has. So push down quite hard and our volume without air is 7.5. So 7.5 mils. So we can deduce that the volume of air is 4.5 mils in solid A. So I'm then going to pop our 10 grams back into the wee boat. Soil sample B, we're going to do exactly the same. So there we go, we've got exactly 10 grams of soil B. We're going to transfer it into a syringe and find out the volume of air.
we go. So that's our 10 grams of soil B in the syringe. I'll just level it up. So our starting volume for soil B is 13 mils. And then we're going to push down on the plunger to push out all the air. And our final reading is 7 mils. So the volume of air in soil B is 6 mils. We're going to do the same again. We'll return our soil sample to our wee boat. And then we will repeat with soil sample C. So with 10 grams, pop it into our plunger. In. Level it up. So our starting reading is 12 mils for soil C. And then I'm going to push the plunger down to push out all the air. And that's gone down to seven mils. So the volume of air in soil C is five mils. And again, I'm going to pop our sample back in the weigh boat. for our next task. So our volume of air for each soil, soil A had 4.5 mils, soil B had 6 mils and soil C had 5 mils. 